happening now. Dramatic video of a Detroit gas station shooting leads to the arrest of two people, including the woman seen opening fire. Simon Shaquette is live downtown with how the arrests happened. Simon, tell us. Carolyn, police say our reporting last night helped lead to two of those arrests, and the quality of the video is simply remarkable. Stop the violence, because we will arrest you. It was the shocking video that grabbed the attention of our viewers. This woman, whose face is clearly visible on police surveillance video, now in custody. So is another man who eventually wrestled a gun away from her. Within two hours, literally two hours, that shooter was in custody. Here at Finkel and Greenfield, the altercation quickly turned violent. The woman is one of four people who were in a blue Dodge Charger. The other vehicle, a green Pontiac Grand Prix off to the right. Crystal clear image of the shooter. No mistake. Just before 4.30 a.m. Sunday, a heated argument breaking out between people in both cars. The woman grabs a handgun from the Dodge Charger and temporarily hides it under her skirt. Within a matter of seconds, she opens fire as someone is run over by the driver of the Pontiac. A gun to settle a dispute? I mean, the violence. I mean, you saw the, the video. Mm -hmm. For what? This out-of-control scene captured with high-resolution cameras monitored back at police headquarters as part of the city's new Project Greenlight program. Thanks to a quick police response, a weapon was recovered and others were brought in for questioning. Ultimately, a neighborhood now made safer, especially with news of the two arrests. Incredibly, the man who was run over there in the video not seriously injured. The other person who was shot still in the hospital in temporary serious condition. Live downtown, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News. That is hard to watch play out. Thank you so much, Simon.